first part of image enhancement there are two types of image enhancement one is point processing and second is neighbor of processing so in point processing you have to perform or you have to change pixel by pixel but in case of neighbor of processing instead of changing the pixel if suppose you want to change the center pixel then you have to consider the eight neighbors of that pixel also for having that value so that is called as neighbor of processing so you have to consider neighbors of the pixel in neighborhood processing, we will discuss low pass filtering and high pass filtering. First of all, if suppose any image we have, then that image will have two frequencies, low pass and high pass. Whatever we are discussing, it is regarding spatial domain, not in a frequency domain. So in spatial domain, frequency which is not changing drastically that is called as low pass this is not changing this is not changing means black 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 completely as well as this white it is not drastically changing so that part is low pass region and high pass means edge this edge where from black to white you are changing from black to white black to white so this is nothing but drastic change this region is called as high pass region so whenever we are applying low pass filtering so at that time whole image will remain same only the edges will get blur this edges those edges will get blur and whenever we are performing high pass filtering the low pass region will be removed means and only edges will be shown so edge uh, the outline of the tree will be shown if we apply high pass filter so first of all we will discuss low pass filtering in low pass filtering we will use mask 3 by 3 mask or 5 by 5 mask so because we will get some center so this is the low pass filter mask with all ones and phase divided by 1 by 9 while applying low pass filtering uh, on over the image suppose this is the image and this is the mask then you have to move this mask over the image horizontally and then like this you have to move over the image and you have to find the output so how that will be moved for example this is the image with or uh, this is the mask any mask how to apply mask so mask with the weight w1 w2 w3 w4 w5 w6 w7 w8 w9 and you want to change this pixel you want to change this pixel with coordinate x comma y coordinate and value any value suppose value is 2 it is 3 4 1 2 1 3 4 5 So this mask will be placed so center will be placed here and the mask you will put mask like this one so 3 by 3 mask so w1 will be multiplied with the first element w2 will be the second w3 with third w4 with next w5 with this one w5 6 w7 with 3 w8 with 4 w9 with the 5 and whatever summation will be there we have to divide by 9 so that is called as the mass application of the mass and we are uh, so we are learning here the low pass filtering low pass filtering for example this is image number 5612312315662813742 and the mask is 111111111 so w1 is 1 so this w1 is 1 w2 is 1 so all 1 so whenever you are applying so you have to multiply this 1 with 5 so w1 with 5 w1 with 5 plus w2 with 6 with w3 with 1 so in w3 you have to multiply it with 1 then w4 with 1 w5 with 2 w6 with 3 so you have to write it after that 1 by 9 first 5 5 into 1 5 plus 6 
so answer is 32 by 9 so that is equal to 3 so while writing program you have to consider the neighbors if suppose x comma y is the pixel then it is nothing but x plus 1 y it is x minus 1 y it is x y plus 1 it is x y minus 1 diagonally it is x minus 1 y minus 1 x plus 1 y plus 1 this is x plus 1 y plus 1 and this is nothing but x plus 1 y minus 1 so because pixel if suppose this is a pixel and neighboring pixel horizontally they are separated by distance 1 suppose it is 1 next should be 2 so everywhere you, have, you are adding by 1 so I will write the program for low pass filtering so low pass filter first I will perform operation on the image that is letter T with this on this so I will write T is equal to I am read the name of the image is I will have the name So this will save. I am ready. It will read the image and the variable will be A. So I will save it. So it will be the size of A. So how many rows and how many columns? Then I will write for loop for i is equal to. I will start from two because first row you can't access because the minus one row is not available. So you have to start from two to m and for j is equal to 2 to n minus 1 so both should be minus 1 then here you have to specify the mask with the weight so w is equal to you can have that mask <coughs> 1 1 1 1 1 1 1 1 1 So first value will be accessed by w of 1, w of 2 so that as we know if suppose new image is b of ij, i comma j is equal to <coughs> so b of j is w1 into f of x minus 1 y plus 1 so it will be w of 1 multiplied by the value is image is a so that a of first x minus 1 so x instead of that it is i i minus 1 comma j plus 1 so first value will be w minus uh, w of 1 a i minus 1 so you can add it from then w of 2 w of 2 multiplication with so next will be x y plus 1 so it is a of i comma j plus 1 plus w of 3 that will be multiplied with a of next will be i plus 1 j plus 1 plus w of 3 3 multiplied by a of so next pixel will be x minus 1 y so it is i minus 1 comma j then plus w of 4 w1 2 3 we have accepted the image in variable a1 then we have written double of a1 then after that we have found out size m n means whatever variable or image the size in terms of rows and columns are calculated in m and n now w is the mask 
with all one now we can try uh, we have written the for loop uh, according to this one we have written x1 x minus 1 y of plus 1 multiply by w1 so uh, here it is w1 a of i minus 1 plus b plus 1 so similarly it is written for all the nine pixels so this mask will be or uh, this mask will be transferred or taken over whole image then c is nothing but u into 8 whatever v value we are getting that is converted into u into 8 uh, unsigned integer 8 and then this i am shown i will run it execute it so this is the image after performing the operation low pass filtering one by one we will start initially a1 is the value or a1 is the matrix where we have saved the image okay so in this image as a t this is black and white all are zeros and wherever white portion that is 255 so this is 255 so wherever t it will be 255 now you can see this pixel with uh, 119 and 87 this is 121 now after that it will um, uh, we have make it uh, as the double so i will show you what change with the double so that is a so 119 first pixel 121 variable a variable a1 is 121 variable a so double it is taken as a double <coughs> so here you can see a1 is integer type a is double after that you have m and n size of a so it is m gives you size 540 and gives 420 see this a1 is 540 by 40 so rows and columns 540 and 420 are written after that you have performed the operation and that values are stored in b so i will show you b so 119 somewhere okay. So this is the first value whatever we have received so 13.444 is 34.555 so it is a double time double so convert that into integer unsigned integer so after having that function u into 8 b so that will convert the values into c that is integer so that the value will be and then 13 and 34 so it is converted as an unsigned integer so earlier it was 13.444 is converted as 13 integer so double 34 next it is converted as 34 so integer if you, you zoom in this particular image you will find that the edges are blurred features are blurred I will show you original image. I am show of A1. A1. So if you zoom it, this page is not that much blurred as compared to whatever I am show the image is stored in C. So if you zoom in. much difference we are getting and zoom in 
the original image you can zoom out if you compare this one and this one somewhat or some smoothing is done so that is called as low pass filter other remaining part it is same only edges are smoothen so that is called as low pass filter here one line you will find somewhere intensity a gradual change in the intensity here single some line so that is called as low pass filter